Hi, I'm Max. And I'm Isaiah. Today is November 18th, and on today's show, we have information about clubs, meetings, and updates for everyone. Now for today's lunch. We have cheese pizza, broccoli, and assorted fruit, and the chef's choice soup. Don't forget to check out all the other dining options. The Cape Henlopen Theater prevents, presents their fall play, Radium Girls, this weekend. Performances will be held at the Cape Henlopen High School on Friday and Saturday at 7 p.m. and Saturday and Sunday at 2 p.m. Purchase tickets online at r.show slash cape theater slash radium girls or at the door before the show. Anime Matinee Sundays, now to December 18th at 2 p.m. at the Rehoboth Art Cinema, behind the Wawa. This week's movie is Howl's Moving Castle. Student price is $5 with ID. For more information, go to the website. NASA has recently launched their new Artemis One rocket, lifting off from the Kennedy Space Center in Florida on Wednesday, November 16th. This will be our first unmanned mission to go to the moon. Script's still rolling. There we go. The Valhalla yearbook staff has been working hard to make an awesome yearbook for you. Order your yearbook today to get the lowest price. Visit jostinyearbooks.com or scan a poster in the hallway to order. And now to Faculty Friday. Uh, I really like the students and the other teachers here. It's, it's kind of my favorite part of the thing. We've got some really, really cool and interesting people, um, both students, and we've got great teachers that I really enjoy working with. Um, I'm, I mean, I'm really into music, obviously, so I go to a lot of concerts, I play a lot of music. Uh, I'm a huge 76ers fan, although they're making me sad lately. And uh, I, I've been disc golfing lately, that's a good time. Now to this week's Cape Sports. Welcome back to Cape and Open Sports. We're your hosts Gus and Jackson. Today we'll be going over upcoming playoff schedules and recaps. In the quarterfinals, the field hockey team took down Milford 6-0. In the semis, they defeated Padua 5-1. The state championship will take place this Saturday at the University of Delaware against Smyrna at 2. The football squad takes on the number one seed Smyrna in the quarterfinals at Smyrna tomorrow at 7 o'clock. Unified Flag Football took down William Penn Tuesday in a first round matchup, 55 to 42. They will take on the number one seed, Newark Charter, Wednesday, November 30th. Now, here's a quick interview with some fans and teachers. Soccer, that's the best sport in the world. The Cape football team, uh, boys volleyball, just a good sport. At Cape, I'd have to say the football team, man. Some great kids, man. Talented kids, they go out there, they put in the work, love them. Thank you for watching Cape Lopen Sports. We will see you next time. And now to Elena with your weekend weather update. Hi, my name is Elena Vest, and here's your weekend weather report. Today on Friday, we have a high of 50, sunny but partly cloudy. And tomorrow, Saturday, at University of Delaware, it will be cloudy with a chance of W's. Come support your Cape and Lopen field hockey team in the state championship, 230 UD. Be there. Thank you for watching the Cape Report. Here's today's birthdays. Have a great Cape Day.